Puffins, puffins, puffins. And we're here <laughs> with the main man himself, Bjorn Torfinson. And, uh, well, Bjorn, uh, your team, I think, in my eyes at least, and I think in the eyes of the, the fans, the puffins from Reykjavik is becoming a bit legendary, uh, Bjorn. And, well, do you want to tell us a little bit about the puffins? I know you guys. You're, you're a very good friend of mine. And uh, yeah. who are the puffins, Bjorn? The Puffins is just the Reykjavik chess community, and we uh, we are like uh, what we are four GMs, and then the and the and then the yeah the people just who are playing in in Reykjavik, and we are just all located here in the greater Reykjavik area. And I have to say, Bjorn, Reykjavik is one of my favourite places in the world. Um, you are loved here, Simon. Ah, oh, that's very kind. That's very kind. I mean. Uh, I have to say, the first time, Bjorn, I think I went to Reykjavik, I met one of your friends, you, you can probably tell me his name a bit later, he's like the crazy fisherman, and yeah. um, we were walking to a pub, this is my first time in Reykjavik, and on the way to the pub, he, he, he stopped, and, he, and you were like, oh no, not again, and uh, he made this noise, like, Ugh, and he lifted this car up and he moved it around. Do you know the guy I'm talking about? <laughs> yeah, he's it's, it's actually my namesake, his name is also Bjorn. Bjorn, Bjorn talking yeah. about, okay. So, <laughs> There's a lot of Bjorns over there. Yeah, and that's just what people do. They move cars when they're drunk. <laughs> Standard yeah. practice. Uh, you're all crazy, aren't you, basically, in Reykjavik, but in a lovely way, in a lovely way. You, you have to be to just uh, survive here in the, in, the, in the north. I mean, there's a <laughs> snowstorm outside here, and uh, if, you, if you don't have uh, fun with life a little bit, then you're just going to be struggling here. Just struggling. Yeah. <laughs> But anyway, another another reason I, I'll contact you is um, basically I think most people saw your video, which we're, we're yeah. post after this, and this was you in the first round of the Pro Chess League on the yeah. internet, and I'm commentating on the Pro Chess League. But we saw you did a legendary the stuff that heroes and what what do they call <laughs> hero stories over in Iceland? They got a special name, haven't they? What are they called like? Like um, Exactly what I was thinking, Bjorn. Yeah. <laughs> but the you did Viking, a, the Viking sagas. The Viking sagas, and and you yeah. d you did this Viking save, and you then went into some celebration, Bjorn. Tell us about this celebration. I want to hear you shout puffins as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I I probably got a bit uh, emotional. I'm a, an emotional guy, and then uh, okay, we I didn't know what the score was, and I didn't even know if I had to win or not, and then I saw everything was. Uh, not working out as uh, as planned in, in other games, and then I suddenly realized it was eight seven. I had this tricky ending, and uh, and uh, just was just playing on. I didn't even know if I was winning or what. And then then I saw that I had a clear path to victory, and then I started yelling in in Icelandic, "Who is sailing this home? Who is sailing this home?" <laughs> <laughs> it got a bit overboard because the the guys were cheering me on and you know it was good but i mean like you Icelandic guys you you're kind of, you're kind of like love pretty much everywhere i mean the football you know yeah. I, I, the funny thing was Bjorn i was watching yeah. the football on tv i yeah. swear i saw you this is the european two this is the european yeah. championships and yeah. basically like three quarters of iceland went yeah. to watch the football like more people went to watch the football than didn't go and i sure I, I, is this right i was watching the fans I'm yeah. sure I saw your face in the crowd. Is that you, right? You, you saw me in the crowd. <laughs> oh, I did. It was the it was the Iceland versus Portugal g game uh, that we drew one one, and when we scored the equalizer, then uh, my face was like uh, in all the media in the world, and I, I got Brilliant. comments from all over. Brilliant. It was amazing. So you're already famous in the football community and now the chess community. and uh, yeah, yeah, my fat face was everywhere. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> that's a bit harsh. <laughs> but Bjorn, I mean, you're, you're an international master and uh, yeah. you're going for the Grandmaster title. You played, uh, you got your last Grandmaster norm, I guess, in Bunratty where we were playing. That, that was fun. No, that, that, was the, that was the second. That was the second one. So you've only got one, one more norm to get. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then and you'll then, be uh, Grandmaster. And then the, the the rating at some point, I, I I don't know about that. I always climb up and then I slip back down. It's, but we'll I, see. I, I would I would I wouldn't say slip with you. It's more like fall very quickly. Yeah, fall very, <laughs> on, on my face. Yeah, yeah. But I, I think I, I think I have, like I, me. I have some very ups and downs. I I, I yeah. have some moments and I have some yeah. absolute horrible times. Yeah, I mean you're you're a bit like me. You're very emotional, a very emotional player, and you can either play brilliantly or pretty yeah. bloody awful. I think, yeah. and uh, yeah. so you, you know, you're a great player to watch. 
But, yeah. I, regu- I regularly disgrace chess and, and sometimes I honor it sometimes. <laughs> and you honored the puffins the other day, of course. Yeah. <laughs> so, well, good I Bjorn. hope so. But, and uh, also Reykjavik, I mean, we should mention the Reykjavik Open is coming up. We'll give a little bit of publicity. That is in, do you know the dates? I'm trying to remember the dates myself. Is yeah, it? yeah. They, okay. It starts the 19th of April. Yeah, okay. It's going to be very strong. It's, yep. it's going to be Jo Bava and, and, and Andre Kinn and, and some Williams. amazing players. Williams, I hope uh, you should play. I, I, or either play or do the commentary. I, I, I'm, I'm yeah, okay. promising to be okay. there. I will be there, Bjorn. You, you will be there in, in some, some way. Some way. But, uh, do you promise to share a Viking beer with me? Because the beer over there is, of course, called Viking. So is it Viking? There will be a, yeah. a Viking beer every night, Sam, for yes, sure. Yes, get in there. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it already. And yeah. so, yeah, I have to say, it is my favourite tournament in the world, that in Gibraltar. Uh, so everyone should get over there for it. And uh, have you got any other crazy stories, you know, you'd like to mention before I, you know, just uh, turn off this broadcast of Iceland. I mean, obviously Bobby Fischer lived there in his last yeah. years. I mean, you've got a lot of crazy people over there. Have you got anything you just want to, you know, off the top of your head you can think of? Uh, that you're allowed uh, to say? <laughs> somebody somebody has to think about the children, Simon. Okay. I, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, will, I will think of something for the next episode because, uh, I mean... Okay. Uh, Next next week, uh, the regular puffins, the puffins, the puffins are playing the 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 Stockholm snowballs. Okay. And you know us Icelanders, we know a thing or two about snowballs. So yeah. uh, I, I I guess w- I'm pretty confident we will get a, a good result. They if if they wanted to uh, do well against the regular puffins, they should have named themselves Stockholm Sunshine or something that we know nothing about. Ah, that's it. But when it's snow, you're the you're the masters of the snow, yeah. If, but, if if Icelanders won't uh, want to do well against a team called the Snowballs, I mean, yeah, that's bad. That's a bad choice. You are the yeah. land. You are the original. You know, Vikings. The the basically the people of uh, the people of the snow. I can remember you yeah. telling me some funny things. But anyway, we better not go everywhere because we're getting. <laughs> 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 but anyway, Bjorn, uh, stay on the line. Uh, I'm gonna just finish this video now. But I'll, I'll say a quick goodbye. And um, yeah, just it's an honour to have Bjorn Torfinsson in. We should mention he has a brother, Bray, um, who's also very strong, about the same standard as Bjorn. Who who is he playing as well? Bjorn? Yeah, he, he he played he played last week as well. Brilliant. Did, did okay, but but yeah. the thing is, he he made the mistake of not being uh, like we, we were all playing in the Icelandic headquarters, uh-huh. and it was a lot of fun. We were uh, sure. like Party. when we were w- winning our games, yeah. we uh, we we were screaming something like uh, like yeah. like I was doing in the last game, <laughs> like little babies. So, uh, <laughs> so it was like a like being at a at a football game, and and Brian was at home with his wife and kids playing. Oh. So he he missed the excitement. He's he missed the be, atmosphere. Yeah, he's gonna be he's gonna be there uh, for the next match, and and we're gonna introduce uh, uh, Grandmaster and the legendary Grandmaster Johan Kjartarsson. Oh, brilliant! He's gonna play our top board brilliant. next this week, this Wednesday. That's gonna be absolutely amazing. This Wednesday. Yeah. So I can't wait. You're gonna record it all again. You must. We must record it. Yeah, all again. yeah. I mean, yeah. Ingvar is gonna be the, with a brilliant. with a, with a recorder brilliant. again. So let's see. Yeah. But the thing is that Hjartarsson is such a respected and legendary GM. I'm, I'm not sure if I would go this overboard, but we'll we'll see. You if it's exciting, <laughs> I probably will. <laughs> you probably will. Good stuff, yeah. Bjorn. And uh, yeah, well, everyone should tune in. Pick your if you're if you're watching this home, and you want to pick your favorite team. This is the Pro Chess League. It's one of the biggest things, the biggest thing ever to happen online in the chess community. And, you know, I have to say I've got to go for the London teams, but certainly up there is one of my favourites. And the team I want to do well is the Reykjavik Puffins because they're just a lovely bunch of people, probably as much as the London teams, actually. I, I want to see you crush everyone. You know, I don't care. It's, you know, sod London. I want to see the Puffins. Puffins. and, and you've, to... you've eaten a Puffin. Sorry? I've eaten, eaten the Puffin. puffin. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah, I have. Haven't you? Didn't you, go, didn't you used to be a Puffin hunter or something? Or, uh, I, I I have gone on a puffin hunt. Okay, well so, there you uh, go. They're, <laughs> Poor they're little beautiful birds, but they're also really delicious. <laughs> <laughs> spoken, spoken like a pure Viking. Yeah, so yeah. good stuff. And Bjorn, just to finish the show, can you shout yeah. puffin, puffin, puffin for us? The puffins, the puffins, the puffins, the puffins. Perfect. And slowly it fades away into eternity. 